Those people need your help. I'm not as strong as you. No. You're stronger. Hey comic ninjas, this is Rich and I'm back with another video and I don't think we need a spoiler warning for this because this is based on a topic that I posted to reddit and we had some very good conversation about this and the discussion that we had was in Avengers 4 will we see Tony Stark visit his dad Howard Stark we've seen a lot of Howard in the MCU we've seen him in Iron Man 2 where we had that very emotional connection we've seen him in captain america first avenger civil war and we also saw him in ant-man tony has always had that regret in himself for not having that relationship that he wished he had with his father in iron man 2 tony sees where it seems as if howard never cared for him but in turn turned out to be the other way tony you're too young to understand this right now, so I thought I would put it on film for you. I built this for you. You will change the world. What is and always will be my greatest creation is you. And in the beginning of Civil War with the barf tech, we see how Tony makes his regretful remarks and wishing the interaction that he had with his father was the way that he wished it happened. I love you, Dan. And I know you did the best you could. That's how I wish it happened. What I find interesting out of Howard's position in the MCU is the relationship that Howard Stark has with Hank Pym. In Ant-Man, we saw that Hank Pym doesn't like Howard, and Hank knows that Howard only wishes to get his hands on the Pym particles. Hank, we need you. The Pym particle is a miracle, please. Don't let your past determine the future. As long as I am alive, nobody will ever get that formula and now with what we foresee to come in the avengers 4 according to the set photos is the fact that scott lang the new ant-man and tony stark will have to work together so now stark tony stark at least will have his hands on pym particles i think that's a pretty cool correlation hank pym doesn't want to work with stark scott knows that he shouldn't trust a stark Hank Pym always said you never can trust a Stark. Who are you? Come on, man. But now he needs to work with Tony Stark in order to save the universe. So, where would we see Howard Stark? One way I see this happening is perhaps during a fight, Tony realizes that the only way he could win is if he sacrifices himself. So, in the midst of a fight, Somehow, some way, he'll jump time or reality, and you'll get a scene similar to Thor and Odin's in Thor Ragnarok, where Odin helped Thor find his powers, but instead with Tony, I would think it would be for a sacrifice. Not necessarily saying he would die in a sacrifice, but it would be an attempt, kind of like the first Avengers, where he took the nuke through the portal and he made a somewhat sacrifice, where he acknowledged the fact that it was possible that he wouldn't be coming back. So yeah guys, I really wanted to make this quick video because I wanted you guys to get involved in the comment section to hear each other's ideas and what you guys think we're gonna see in Avengers 4 that we don't really know for sure that's going to happen. Like Captain Marvel's introduction to the Avengers, we know we're gonna see that. So just to wrap it up, I appreciate the recent love and support and I'm really gonna start posting more often. So please subscribe if you haven't yet. And comment down below, I really want to know what you guys think we're going to see in Avengers 4.